Hi, this is Fred. We're going to give you an overview of Big Blue Button from the viewer's perspective. We'll start first by loading into the client, and in the upper left-hand corner, you'll see that there's a users module. This module shows you the users that are logged in over the web. You'll see yourself appear here. Your name will be in blue. And as other users join, you'll see them appear in the list. And there, Tyler has just joined. And Tyler has joined with the role of a moderator. You can see in the role, and he's the current presenter as well. Big Blue Button allows you to chat with the other participants and students. So I can chat by just typing into the text field and hit enter. Everyone sees it and there, Tyler has responded. You can do a private chat by clicking the plus and then the person's name and then just choosing their tab. Here, the message that I type will only be seen by Tyler. So we'll ask how long is the class and in a moment, Tyler will respond. If you're in a private chat and there's information in the public chat, you'll see it glow orange. Just click on all and you'll come back to the public chat, which everybody can see. To join the audio conference in Big Blue Button, just click the headset icon and you'll be asked by Flash to have permissions to access your microphone. You'll see an audio settings dialog that lets you play a test sound. Just make sure your speakers are working. And then you can see if the volume indicator is moving when you talk. If it's not, just click the change microphone and choose a different microphone. Everything looks good, so we'll just join the audio. And you now appear in the listener's window. This shows you who can also hear, and you can mute and unmute yourself by just clicking the mute or talk button. This lets you control your audio as well. There, Tyler's just joined, and Tyler is the moderator, so he can mute and unmute others as well. Next, what we'll do is we'll wait until Tyler there has just uploaded a presentation. Now, Tyler is a presenter, so we will see wherever uh, the presenter is pointing the mouse. And you can see here, you can, the red dot's moving around. You can see as it's changing slides. And the presenter also has the ability to mark up the presentation using a whiteboard marker. So here, Tyler is just indicating two points in the presentation. And you can see the whiteboard controls. Again, we see exactly what the presenter sees. Tyler can also share his or her webcam. And we can share a webcam as well by clicking the share webcam icon in the upper left hand corner. And I can choose a different webcam source, but this looks good. So I'm just going to click the play button and then Big Blue Button says you're publishing. In the video doc, all the webcams will be uh, collected and you can click one to make it larger. Finally, in the upper right hand corner, you can choose a different language for Big Blue Button. It's localized into over 35 languages. And we'll leave it in English here for the moment. And when you're done, you can just click log out. That's it. That's an overview of how to use Big Blue Button from a viewer. Big Blue Button is an open source web conferencing system for distance education.